What's up guys, welcome back to this week's video. So in this week we're going to be fitting the stickers on this side panel of the doors. Um, I'm first going to attempt that before I do the rear, um, the boot, because obviously like I said, the window has to be removed. So before I do or get someone to come in and do that for me, um, I'm first going to attempt the stickers on the side pillars of the doors. So if I get that right and then obviously I will have someone come out and take the window out and then I can do the boot. So I'm going to start with that today. This is what I'll be working with today. This is obviously the stickers. You can see there's four for each door. And then I've got some soapy water and a microfiber towel and then a squeegee to push out the bubbles and the excess water. And then if I can't get um, all the bubbles out, I'll use the spin just to poke a hole in it so that I can get the air out of there and then obviously a um, hair dryer in case I need to heat up the rubbers just to fold it over. I have to remove this rubber same as the back so the sticker fits in there but this is fairly simple as you just pull off and then this piece of plastic over here this just clips out as well it's all done with some glue so the sticker can fold in here and in here as well and then the rubber and the clip will cover it to give it a nice clean neat finish but um, I need to clean the surface first because obviously you want to work on a clean surface with a sticker and then once that's clean I'm going to remove this and then we can try and put it so you can see how easy it was to remove those rubbers um, just be careful when you're taking this one off because there is a bit of um, metal on the side of that at the bottom of that rubber so it might scratch the paint but other than that it's fairly simple to take off the window must be down to take this one off the water will allow me to um, maneuver the sticker so I can line it up properly first one done um, I'll just show you what I picked up and like see if I can give you some tips on what I picked up while doing this whole job it took a little longer than expected but this is the first time I'm trying it so that's um, expected so I'll just show you what I picked up if you look closely over here um, I cut it you can't really see but if you come really close you can see when I cut to bend this piece in I cut a bit too far so just hold that in mind if you're going to do this yourself and don't cut too far um, on this section and here at the bottom you can see as well right over there I cut this too far but in order for it to bend over I had to cut it so next one I'll try not to cut too far in and then I also used the squeegee um, I squeegeed all of the water out downwards so I pressed from the top and I worked all the water down. There were some areas where um, bubbles came and I just removed it a little bit, um, sprayed some water on and then squeegeed it out and then also I used the hair dryer to add some heat to make it bond. That took me about I'd say 25 minutes to get the first one done but like I also said it was my first attempt so hopefully the others will go much smoother. Um, yeah, I'm gonna start with the back one now and then work my way to the other side and finish it off. So the back obviously needs to be lined up nicely with the front. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use some of this um, tape and I'm just gonna make a straight line over here and then one at the bottom as well. And I'm gonna open this door and then hopefully that will give me a nice straight line and line it up nice and evenly so I don't have skew lines on either end. Stickers come with this. I don't know if you can see this over here, it's like a small little edge on here and that what I'm using that as the marker to fold so that will be lined up on the edge over here because that will be my corner where I fold and then and then the same at the bottom over here I'll line it up over there and that's where I will fold the stick yeah flex I just want to win yeah LA BB who we running with yeah 2233 I'm on 10 again 
name Big been dope on flame, I just switched the lanes Damn he did it again, I just flipped the pain Stripping and dipping in bass, slap on everything Swimming, you shaking away, cause I got big racks coming I put my low racks on it I ain't skip past losses, I had to get back off it See the fit lab on it until they whip my coffin Money clip, I tossed it, I heard it's big bags on big bags on big bags coming Uh uh, coming in And there we go, that's the back complete um, The sticker was slightly skewed, not me, but yeah It's slightly off over here, as you can see Slightly skew there and it lines up nicely on top so the sticker was off a bit um, not me the rubbers give it a nice clean smooth finish and then this as well you can see the clip clips it in and gives it also a nice seamless finish um, the part that I struggled with the most was the bottom part over here um, it's usually a lot of it's either wet so once the sticker dries then it takes but you need to get out all the water what I did was I was using the squeegee to get out all the water and then as well as the hair dryer just to heat it up and make it bend and take just be careful with the cut you're gonna need to cut I tried to do it without cutting it but it didn't curve nicely and it left like a little bubble over here so I had to cut in there but you don't want to cut too far and you notice the cut like you can see over here I did it fairly decently you don't really notice it but on this side if you look closely you'll see where I cut over here I mean the kit is usually supposed to come with a sticker inside here which gives it a nice finish so you don't see it um, the gap when the door is closed but this didn't come with that so maybe I have to have a sticker made up separately for that before I forget I just want to give a big shout out to us if um, he left a comment in one of my videos regarding the grommet that I was looking for and yeah, I really appreciate that so big shout out to Asif um, I leave the comment here somewhere on the screen so you can see the name of the place that he recommended So this is the grommet I was referring to I plugged the hole that was originally um, the aerial that was in here so yeah, it fit in perfectly I think this was number 43 The place is quite a gem um, That's the first time I've heard of it and it's in Maitland so they have a bunch of rubbers, plastic, piping, everything, you name it, um, rubbers for the inner of the doors as well. So yeah, check it out if you're looking for some rubbers. Now I need to finish this side off. Hopefully um, the stickers are in skew and it lines up a bit more straighter on this side. Flex, I just wanna win. Yeah. LA BB who we running with. Yeah. Two, two, three, three, I'm on ten again. Yeah. State your name. Big been dope on flame, I just switched the lanes Damn he did it again, I just flipped the pain Stripping and dipping in bass, slab on everything Swimming you shaking away, cause I got big racks coming I put my low racks on it, I ain't skip past losses I had to get back off it, see the fit lab on it Until they whip my coffin, money clip I tossed it I heard it's big bags on big bags on big bags coming Uh uh, coming in, yeah Flex, I just wanna win all four sides are now on so the sticker in general is slightly skew like minimal so you're either gonna have to sacrifice being skew on top or slightly off at the bottom but it's not that noticeable only if you like really stay and look at it but from afar it's not really noticeable um, you can get away with it but um, yeah like I say the sticker seems to be slightly off but it is what it is I'm gonna go with it it looks decent this actually came out originally on the CTIs um, it might have came out on the Mark 1 GTIs as well I'm not too sure about that I could be wrong but it definitely came out originally on the CTIs and then later on on the city golf the R lines these sides came out and then also on the back so I'm feeling much more comfortable now to do the back so next week I'm gonna have someone come out and remove the window for me and then I can fit the back and the spoiler as well I'm pretty happy with how it turned out um, considering it was the first time that I did it and I didn't run into much problems you can see the finish is quite nice as well there's not much bubbles or any like I say the sticker is skewed so it is slightly skewed at the bottom but besides that the finish the finish is really nice so we're getting there slowly but surely boys and girls um, and I'm gonna cut it off over there I was gonna do the front number plate but I don't want to really um, extend or make 
extremely long video so I think I've got enough footage with the stickers so I'm gonna end it off there um, I hope you guys enjoyed I'll see you guys next week peace yeah.